Hi, I'm Eli. And I'm Diego. And this is our capstone project, I Heart STEM. For our grade 12 capstone project, we are doing our project on both coding and fitness. We want to better enhance our learning on both computers and weightlifting. We decided to create a heart rate sensor that can track the time that each heartbeat takes and use that to determine the heart rate of the user. We coded the heart rate sensor using Arduino, a C++ coding language. The way that the sensor works is that it shines an LED into your fingertip and measures the amount of light reflected back. When you place it on your fingertip and your heart beats, a surge of blood moves through your finger, causing the change in the reflected and absorbed light. The code for this whole setup is quite complicated, and the order of when things happen is extremely important. So here's a short walkthrough of our code. Firstly, we installed a bunch of libraries that we can use to set variables and use functions. Next, we declare all of our variables by naming them and defining them as integers. These are global definitions, meaning the entirety of the code sees them. In the void setup, we initialize the liquid crystal display and tell it to print the BPM. Finally, in the void loop, we create a variable named signal and use it to show when a heartbeat happens. Next, we use an if statement to make the LED blink when a heartbeat occurs. From there, we use complicated code that can track the time elapsed between heartbeats and use it to create an equation that gives us BPM. Then we created a spreadsheet in order to track our exercises along with our important variables, weight, breathing rate, time, and reps. The different activities that we tracked are bench press, squats, 50 meter sprint, and 2.5 kilometer run. The difficulties we faced during this project were very common, but very helpful. We ran into a lot of errors during our code and it seemed never ending, but each one gave us something new to learn about. For this project, we both decided to create goals for how much weight we could lift. Eli had a goal of bench pressing 135 pounds, and Diego had a goal of 175. We both achieved these goals and have continued to make more progression. We didn't have specific goals for our squats or our runs. We just wanted to be able to improve and track our improvement throughout. One mistake that we made that we would change if we were to do the project over again was our time management. The amount of time it took to code the heart rate sensor was a lot longer than we expected, so we didn't have time to work on our wearable model.